and gentlemen, if you thought yesterday's Fortnite video was huge, today's is doubly as big because we aren't just looking at one new place on the Fortnite map. We are looking at two new places on top of the city that we looked at yesterday that will be coming to Fortnite Battle Royale next week in a huge, huge update. So guys, earlier today, Fortnite put out a developer update where they answered the questions from us, from the fans, from the players, and they specifically covered these brand new points of interest, which I have locked down, found on the map again for you guys. And we're going to take a look at exactly where they are. Now remember, if you're new around here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell to see the videos as soon as they go live on my channel, becoming a part of a notification squad, because as soon as these brand new places go live next week, I'm going to have a load of videos covering all of them, and I'm so excited for it. So first of all, let's take a look at some new shots of the brand new city, which we took a look at yesterday. If you ever look on screen here, you can see exactly where that is going to be falling. It sits almost directly in between Pleasant, Loot Lake, and Greasy Grove, and it's going to be the biggest brand new update to the map coming next week. However, alongside these new shots of this brand new city, we've got two new points of interest. Now, as I said, these points of interest aren't quite as big as the large city, which looks absolutely nuts. But add more character, more places to land, and mix up the diversity of the map. The developers actually mentioned that the left side of the map, or as they call it, the west side of the map, was sparse and was a little bit empty. So they're listening to us, and they knew that we needed some more things to fill up that left side of the map. So, Motel, where does this fall? Well, believe it or not, this is actually where Motel is. At the moment, there is currently a house and an outer barn structure already in its position. That is gonna get wiped down, ladies and gentlemen, and replaced with this brand new motel. How can we tell this is the location? Well, the key giveaways is the little red hut on top of the mountain on the left-hand side, and also the trio tree structure on the left-hand side. Where exactly does this fall in the map, though? It's an interesting one. This will actually fall in between both Anarchy Acres and Pleasant Park. As I said, we'll remove the house that's currently there, replace it with a cooler motel, place to land for your friends, and is again filling up that western side of the map. Very, very cool. But that's not the only new place, ladies and gentlemen. Oh no, there is also a brand new scrapyard called the Boneyard, which is being added to the map. Now, honestly, I thought this was going to be added more towards the southern side of the map, maybe near Flush Factory. But this boneyard actually falls very, very close to the motel as well. So let's first of all take a look at the picture of the boneyard. Uh, the biggest giveaway from this was actually pointed out by my editor, Aaron, who said, You can just see the tippity top of another house and also another outer barn structure. And it also looks like it's near the coast because there's only sea in the background. So with that in mind, jumped into the map, and again, we managed to find that spot to find it actually to smash down a load of trees that were currently there. So a lot of current structures are being removed to make space for these new structures. But where does this part of the map actually fall? Well, this part of the map is actually bang right in the top left of the map. You can see that cluster of trees there. Those clusters of trees are gone, will be replaced by the boneyard. It means there's gonna be a lot of activity north of Pleasant Park and give you two places to land to then loot and move into Pleasant Park from. And it's gonna give that west side of the map a lot of action. But it's also very smart, and I mentioned this in yesterday's video, where uh, with City being added, if they only added City at one time, the whole of the battle bus would land there. At least from adding three new points of interest at one time, that's going to spread out the diversity of where people will be jumping at least a little bit. And I'm sure a lot of those gunfights will end up in Pleasant Park, and it's going to be absolutely nuts. The final few points to point out from this is there was actually like a metal piñata on one of the hills in the boneyard picture. So that looks like a fun place that will be able to land that as well. I'm sure there'll be some, some hidden chests hidden in there as well. They also mentioned that once the holiday, the winter holiday event ends, all the Christmas trees and the chests under the Christmas trees will be removed and will be restored to their previous self. So they won't be there basically. But they are looking at future events which will add future um, points which will only be around for those event periods which will again add additional chests etc. So although the winter update is coming to an end and I believe all of those trees will be removed along with the update next week, um, don't worry we'll be getting more updates similar to the Christmas update at a point in the near future. So that's very exciting as well. So guys, I told you it was doubly as exciting. Three new towns are coming next week and we haven't even had a chance to look at the mines that were mentioned as well. No visual look at that quite yet, but we have found, located, and locked down three new positions and I'm so, so excited for this update. Now, talking of this brand new city, I tweeted out yesterday 
for name suggestions for this city. My guess was Central City. Honestly, quite boring. Don't think that is going to be the name. But if you guys have a name suggestion, leave it in the comments down below. I reckon one of you can predict it. And if you can predict it, I'll give you a shout out in next week's video once the update goes live. So good luck, guys. Leave your predictions down below in the comments. But don't go anywhere because I obviously have an awesome gameplay for you guys, as always, for today's Fortnite video. I'm going on a solo mission to take out as many people as I can. Go for a victory royale and get that win. Give it the video a big fat thumbs up if you're excited. And without further ado, guys, let's jump into the gameplay. Oh, we're not going to be able to recreate the epic start, guys. I don't know if you've seen it. Oh, someone's got something already. I don't know if you guys have seen it. If you're not following me on Twitter, what are you doing? Go over there and follow me. I posted... Oh, my God. We have got green AR again, though. This could be... This has potential. This has potential. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to push quite hard and try and make this happen all over again. This guy's just gonna got the chest. Hold on, hold on, give me a second. Where's this guy? What's he doing? What's he doing? Hey, buddy. Let's go. Oh my god, look at this loot. Wow. What a way to start off. Whew. If you don't know what I'm referencing, by the way, I had a start here the other day. You may have seen it on Twitter where I landed on the roof of this factory. Or not this factory. It's actually the building I got my first chest from. And I mowed down like four people with, a, with an AR that I found on the top. It was one of the quickest and bestest starts I've ever had. Cannot lie. You haven't seen the rest of the video, but I actually went on to walk into retail, get myself a few more kills on the, on the way and a kill in retail to get myself about seven kills in about two minutes. I was on track for my best and most kills ever in Fortnite, and then I got shotgunned in the back. Very, very annoying. But you haven't seen the clip yet, it's over on my Twitter. Go over there, scroll a few days back or so, and you'll be able to take a look and drop me a cheeky follow if you haven't done so already. I always tweet about my new videos, as soon as I go live, things I'm recording, Victory Royale, so it's all good in the hood. Where should we go next? Where should we go hunting to, guys? We've got a pretty good loadout at the moment. We do a space for one more item, no? You know what I mean? One more item, what are we saying? Oh, okay. That is what we're saying, apparently. I will take it, and I will put myself in here and drink this very, very nicely. Now, I picked up the pump-action shotgun over the silenced SMG for a very good reason, and that's because I want to use it more, and hopefully I can put it to good use in this video here. Um, uh, the last game I was playing, I picked it up and literally annihilated someone for, like, 200 damage. Oh, what's up, buddy? What's this guy doing? Oh, come on. Let's go. Oh, my God. Ooh, damn. He knocked me down for a lot of health. He's got a shield, though, so it's all good. It's all good. I'm going to drink that right back up. See, like, it, as long as you're getting a body shot, you're, you're, you're guaranteeing yourself, like, 90 to 100 headshots, like, 200 plus. It's like an up-close sniper, and it is well worth getting good at. I feel like I'm just lazy if I'm running around with attack shotgun. Ah, bush not what we want. Ooh, pistol still not quite what we want. We'll take it for the moment, I guess, guys. And, yeah, I recommend it. I'm trying to do it. Come join the squad. Get better with the pump actions. And I've actually got a video. I don't want to give too much away, but I've got a really cool video idea in mind. It's actually... I don't want to give too much away, as I said. But it's about new guns in Fortnite, which is always exciting. We're always looking out for new guns. And it does involve um, the pump action is definitely one I'm going to be looking at quite closely. Has this guy seen me? Ooh, that headshot knocking down a lot of her shield. Ooh, did she pop a mini shield there? What the hell? She must have been... She must... I don't even know. I don't even know. When I dealt that much damage and they still have a... Uh, nope. My, I want to make them. They still have... Oh my god. Chill, 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 chill. Alright, I'm not taking this on right here. Where is that thing? What the hell? Where did that come from? Is this going to be one of those times where I look back in the gameplay or I post a video and you guys are like, Ali, he was clearly there. I don't know where that guy was. I genuinely, I don't know where that guy was at all. I'm going to push up. Maybe he was inside? I don't know. Honestly... When you're playing, things seem to be moving at a million miles an hour. It is so different to when you're watching a video. Is he up here? Is he in a bush? Uh, what the hell? This guy's a ninja? 
I don't know where he's gone. We are on the edge of the ring, though. People are probably going to be coming in hot from Fatal. Don't think it's a chest up in tree. Yeah, what did I say? I called it. People coming in hot. Oh, I can see. Damn. I, I don't like to engage when, they've, when, they, when I know they can move into cover without even building within the next few seconds. Oh, come on. Are you serious right now? Come on. What are you doing? Put that up there. No, 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 no. Don't know why that person didn't move. Great job, Ali. There we go. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna scare her. Watch this. Let's go! Whew. We could have been shot from the side there so easily. We were quite lucky to be honest with you. That person just kind of looked at me. And I don't think he thought I was going to engage at all. I think he was, thought I was totally distracted by the person rushing me from the front. Whew, nice one. I'll take that. Two kills. I can hear... Pick up this beautiful bad boy. I can hear some shots as well. Uh, nothing else we need. I know I've got that slurp. I kind of want to keep hold of it just in case I drop down to... Drop... Oh, what the hell? No one in the bush camping there? Bro, two scars. What the hell? It's my lucky day. Holy, holy moly. It's not this guy's lucky day. I, I told him. I told him it was his lucky day. Oh, poor guy. He even had a med kit. What else has he got? Man, people are piling out of um, fate at the moment. He had a legendary semi-auto snipe. He didn't have much good stuff anyway. It's fine, guys. It's fine. Don't even worry about it. Okay, I want to say a lot of those guys have now come out from Fatal. This person had two scars. Lucky. Well, not so lucky day, unfortunately, anymore. No chest. No chest in there has been taken. All right. All right. The hunt continues, ladies and gentlemen. The hunt does indeed continue. Where is everyone at right now? What loot have you got? Where are you at? And what are you doing? Answer me. <laughs> all right. I demand you give me an answer right now. We've got a good amount of material. Still got that science pistol in my back pocket, just in case you want to be a little bit sneaky. And honestly, six kills with 30 people left is pretty damn good. Um, I really want to get back on the grind of going for high kill games. I, I, I say get back on the grind. I've never, I've never really played specifically to get high kill games. I just sort of play and see what happens. But a lot of the time, I play, I always play with a video idea in mind, you know what I mean? Like I'm always going for something, be it something new or a challenge or a target or something just completely ridiculous. I'm always playing for something in mind. I'm not just playing for a straight up win. And if I did just play for straight up wins, I'm sure I could have a lot more. I'm sure my win loss ratio would be a lot better, but I don't really care about that in this game. But I do want to start getting some more high kill games. Um, me and Rich are in a little bit of a competition. Not really a competition. I mean, he's been playing really well at the moment, but um, I want to get back into getting some more kills. I can see that guy over there. That'll be our seventh with 29 people left. We can finish off this guy. This will be really, really good. Um, where I play full aggro. If you hear anyone saying they're playing full aggro, it means like full on aggressive or aggravator. Or basically, they're just going all out. They're rushing everyone. And I want to start doing that, guys. So look out for more crazy high kill games. Hopefully, this guy's not shooting. Oh my god, oh, he was fully shielded. Thank god, I think I've got, what, two headshots on him maybe? He's got mini shields. Oh my god, this is good, this is good, this is good. Oh, well, we do have seven kills, 27 people left. This is looking like potentially maybe, maybe even 15 kills if, if we play this right. He's got loads of mini shield spare as well, that's what I like to see. That is what I like to see. I'm not going to bother with any of his scope weapons, I don't think. Sniper or scoped. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, maybe I should, I don't know. I like using new things. That's my only problem. The pistol's new. It's sneaky. It's silent. Maybe I'll have to use it. Let's, let's just, let's just keep hold of it for the moment, guys. Numbers are looking good. We're actually heading back over to Greasy Grove, which means an annoying slash very scary run through the valley. And you don't want to be in the valley, guys. If you're ever in the valley, get out the valley. You only ever go through the valley to get to the next ring, all right? This is why you don't want to be in the valley. Are you... S oh my God. That was the worst shooting ever, but somehow paid off. 
I have no idea how I got away with that. Honestly, it looks like that guy's just gone ahead and just looted the person I've just killed and then come on, come over to me. Well, 22 kills left, 8 kills to our name. This is looking really, really good right now. More people to loot. I don't know, I don't know about Greasy Grove. We could roll through Greasy Grove and see what's left, potentially. But honestly, when most people land in Greasy Grove, they, it tends to get cleared. It, dep it depends on the battle bus went, mate. Depends on the battle bus went. Yeah, Greasy is in the next ring. We've got ourselves three beautiful medkits. The max amount of medkits you can hold. I don't know why I just built up to that and then jumped over it, but it's all good. Tempted to potentially check the battle bus. I don't know. Nah. Whew. Let's leave this alone for the moment, ladies and gentlemen. We're doing well. Let's go up to the battle bus and see what's happening over there. Oh my god, I hate it when I hate diagonal building. It looks so sketchy and horrific. And if someone knocks you off it. Oh my god, there's actually one here. Yo, let's go. The battle bus, boys. I've been hitting this up a lot more recently, actually. It's a beautiful place to go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, I'm actually gonna... Because I know... I've been saying that the pistol is new, but honestly, in this serious position where we're doing pretty damn well right now, I don't want to take anyone on with the pistol. The pistol, hey, the pistol's fun and great, don't get me wrong. But with a scar, I've got a better weapon in my hand, which is fully automatic, which can deal more damage per shot. Um, and it's fully auto, you know what I mean? Like, I've got to be sensible here, guys, okay? All right, let's scout, 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 scout. Where are people at? What is happening? What is popping? Okay, we're being dragged away from Greasy Grove. Interesting. Me, my boy, the Dark Knight. We've got to move on. Two supply drops dropping pretty damn close, actually, to be honest with you guys. Whoo. Come on, surely there's someone in the valley. No one in the valley? Why, why do I get shot in the valley? No one else gets shot in the valley. It's just not fair. <laughs> It's okay though. We came out surviving. You know, we didn't even take we didn't even take any damage in the valley. All right. We may hate it, and it may be one of the most dangerous places to get across, but we're fine. All right. This is gonna be an interesting one. I haven't really had a finish. I mean, I don't really spend any time in this part of the map, to be honest with you guys. Oh, someone's building. See that? Someone's building. I reckon I can get some nifty nades on here. If you guys weren't aware. You can hold down the aim of a grenade. Oh. Oh, come on. Damn it, he's fully shielded. Oh my god. Oh my god. Chill, 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 chill. Kind of wish I saved my grenades now. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. I'm being shot at from the right. Oh my god, I'm so- if that- if one shot lands me, I'm dead, guys. <gasps> oh my god! I don't know how I'm alive right now. Oh dear, I don't know where that person's gone. I don't even know- okay, well that's where I'm getting sniped from. The mini tower, obviously. Can't believe that guy got away with it, jeez. He is literally running away, one shot, and he's probably got- actually, I don't know if he picked- He may have full shield. I've seen him. Oh my god, RPG's coming in. I can see it. I don't know where that RPG is coming to. What the hell? Where am I even getting shot from? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not trading well here. I'm not trading well here. Oh my god. There's two people of rockets. I didn't even mean to build that one to the building. Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. I have cheated get death. We were both one shot. And I... Actually, I don't even know if she... I think I may have landed several bullets. <laughs> I should not be alive right now. This is... Ins I've lost my body. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. I have lost my body. Even my character believes he shouldn't be here right now. To a point where he is half left the game. Whew. Are you serious? I should have known that was going to happen. Alright, well, two people on the map of RPGs. So that's just dandy. One of them being the per- Ooh, I'm gonna have an RPG in a second. So that person has an RPG, may not have any rockets left. The person on the hill has an RPG. I've got a legendary RPG. Oh my god, slurp, medkits. Let's get it, boy. 
Okay, let's get it. Okay, I have accidentally dropped my scar, but let's not focus on that right now. Let's use up this med kit. <laughs> let's not focus on the fact I don't have an automatic weapon right now. I have a shotgun and an RPG. And then I think I may pop this slurp in a second. But I really, really, really want to get... Oh, is that coming at me? No one's killed anyone, you know. I don't know what that person's doing. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Give me everything. Everything and anything you've got. Okay, that person's... Okay, I'm on the edge of the ring. This is beautiful. This person's gonna have to move at some point. I'm gonna turn this house into a base, boys. And I'm not gonna let that stay there, because that is just gonna get me destroyed. Let's get out of there. Oh, this is looking nifty, lads. This is looking nifty. I'm gonna set this up. Can't... Nope. What? Okay, there must be something there. Bam. Bam. Where's this person come? He has to have come in. He may be under my base. Very high chance he may be under my base. He may have run at me if he's a bit crazy. If he's not crazy, probably wouldn't. <laughs> How smart is this player? That is the question, guys. Four people remaining. I was so sure there was someone in that, and now I've just realized I think that's what I made. Good job, Ali. So supply drop. I've got a launch pad, you know. There we go. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? What are you doing? Oh, get out of there. You are so dead. You are so dead. Whew, pretty sure about RPG him. And once that happened, with a shot on top of that, he was rip. I think he may have an RPG. I'm going to put in the center there. Really, really sneaky getaway. Okay, guys? If I jump on this... I can go, oh my god, we're on the next ring. Oh. Okay, this is huge. Okay, that's not nice. I'm gonna try. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. My god, that person's terrible, the RPGs. That's gonna miss. See you later. Is that not. Oh, no! No! He broke it, guys! Oh, he broke the launch pad! Okay, there he is. He's on the run. This guy's screwed. Although he's determined to build. I'm gonna break this. Let's go. Let's go, baby! Big builds. Big builds, ladies and gentlemen. Why, I say that? Oh my god! Oh my god, he's got launch pad. Oh my god. Oh my god. Someone just put that slide. Okay, okay. Just steal my kill. Let's go. That should have been my kill. I should be on 12 right now. Oh my god, it's 1v1. Oh, this is turned into... The hell? What? Where'd that... Is he in a bush? Oh, he's right. He was in a bush. Can you believe it? This guy. This guy was trying to hide in the bush from your boy Ali. It ain't happening. 12 kill victory royale. We talked a little bit how I wanted to get some more high kill gameplays. That's not the kind of high, high kills I'm looking for, but it's definitely a decent start. As I said, I also want to do a little video at some point in the near future talking about new weapons that are most likely to come to Fortnite. Make sure you subscribe for that. But ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed another big two more yeah, smash that thumbs up button. Check out the Fortnite place down below right now for more Fortnite videos. Every single one I've ever uploaded in one place. Thank you for watching. You guys are amazing. A 12 kill victory royale. I will take that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for another brand new video. Bye-bye.